Hello friends, welcome to MS Active Webcast and in today's video demonstration we are going to see how we can reset the direct service restore mode means DSRM password in Windows Server 2012 R2 Active Directory. Direct service restore mode password is created during the domain controller promotion process. During the Active Directory domain service installation wizard, you are asked to provide a password for direct service restore mode administrator. This administrator account is separate from the domain administrator account and this account is used once you boot into directory service restore mode. If by chance you forgot the DSRM password you can reset it by performing the simple step. So let's see how we can reset the DSRM password. So on this our domain controller I just log on as a domain administrator's account and let's open the command prompt. Now at the command prompt type NTDS util at NTDS util command prompt type set DSRM password okay and at this reset DSRM administrator password prompt type reset password on server now suppose if you are resetting the DSRM password on a local DC that time you have to type null but in case if you are resetting the DSRM password for another domain controller that time you have to type reset password on server and then you have to specify the server name that time server name will be in a F2DN format and then hit on enter. This will ask for please type a password for directory service restore mode administrator account. Let's specify the password, hit enter, please confirm the password hit enter again and that's it the password has been set successfully at the reset tsrm administrator password type quit quit to exit from ntds utility prompt you have now reset the tsrm password on your local domain controller so this is the way how we can reset the directory service restore mode password on windows server 2012 r2 domain controller